My students get so excited when they come in the classroom because they, they brighten up, they're like, oh, someone's gonna listen to me today about my day. I long for a world so pure and free. I wish for others all I'd wish for me. This is the only Islamic school in San Diego. We are planning to move to, to a new facility. The TK to 12th grade. Right now we are 8th grade and we want to extend to all the way college level. And it's you know bigger facility, everything available over there to make the school according to 21st century requirements. And I found it so fulfilling, even though I was teaching my mom, it, I felt so um, put together and so complete when I was teaching. Um, later on, as I got older, teaching just became a part of me. And I had a child who was having difficulty um, reading. I got him a binder and I got him fun games to do with reading. And by the end of the whole year, he told me, Miss Saima, why did you care so much? And I tell my students every day, you're part of my family because we're here together every day and they should know that there's somebody out there that loves them a lot. I have a eight-year-old daughter who's in the second grade this year. I'm also a member of the Board of Education of the Islamic School of San Diego. My daughter loves coming to school. She wakes up early in the morning, and there were times where she tells me, Mom, can I sleep in my uniform so I'm not late in the morning? And she wants to stay after school, and um, she just loves being you know, here with all of her friends. The reason why I love the Islamic School of San Diego is it's a place where I know I can bring my daughter and she can be around with family and friends and be confident um, that she's going to have a good relationship with her teachers and other parents and community. Um, and we all have the same goal is where to get the best education for all children while they're in Islamic environments. My daughter comes home and tells me highlights of her day, of things that she has learned that she never knew. For ISSC to continue grow and thrive is we need to support our children at home to love our school, to love our teachers, to teach them the values of how important it is to memorize and learn about Quran, about the Arabic language, about uh, science and math, the importance of the, uh, the Muslim scholars and the importance of being there for one another and support one another in our community. You feel like it's your family and you spend more time in the school more than at your own house. I'm serving Muslim kids and they are not just students, they are my, my own kids and I see my future in them, the future of the whole Ummah, inshallah. We expect and hope to inspire our kids to live a life uh, that is based on the values of Islam, realize their true potential by giving them high quality education and continue to enrich the community with really sound Muslims who are uh, well situated in their identity of an American Muslim. Diocese Girls Dawah Committee is a group of girls that help educate ourselves about Islam as well as others and also host activities. Joining this club was so that um, I can make a difference in my life and the lives of others around me. Uh, the reason why me and Hamza created this committee is basically to empower the students and let them understand Islam more. <laughs> <laughs> Just being true to myself and true to you. True love. Now raise your hands and let's be thankful. We have science fair, science olympiad, and robotics clubs, and our students competing with other you know, public school students locally and in statewide, even nationwide. And we have many awards and trophies, and you know our school well known. The three goals of the PDO are number one is to plan and organize events for our kids. Number two is to connect uh, the parents with their school. And number three is to help provide the school with any extra supplies they would need. We attended the Sunday's session at the masjid to help non-Muslims learn more about Islam. I joined the ISST Dawah committee to become a better person and to remind myself of Allah.
I really thank from bottom of my heart all the teachers and students, staff members, community members. Okay, they are you know doing great and we are working together. Thank you very much.